How's it going, everyone? Tony here at FX Street. Today, I'm going to be going over Binance against the US dollar. Uh, before we get into this video, make sure you guys know, check us out on YouTube at FX Street, Twitter at FXS Crypto. I'm personally on TM Charts 100 for historical purposes. Thank you guys so much for those of you who have joined. Yeah, so Binance had a nice little trade set up. Um, I'm in spot. Been an in since down here. It's a five. 0.7 to 1. I'm trying to take it all the way to 330. That's the spot. And then I also went on um, Twitter and I posted a nice little leverage trade. It was BNB back to 280. It was about a 2 to 1. And it, yeah, just completely blew past me. <laughs> blew past me. So it looks like it's going for the move. I think, I think we're going to see some resistance at 3LT, some 302, 303, some justified resistance. I wouldn't be surprised if it comes down, starts to wipe guys out, and then makes a move. I so said I wouldn't be surprised. It doesn't have to happen that way. It could also just kind of consolidate up here and then also move that way. So that's your two scenarios. Um, yes, yeah, you can see there's some nice accumulations in here. Some nice... Um, some nice accumulations in here. So it's built up its cause, you know. This is a cause and this is your effect. So it's I think it's gonna get to 330. Um Binance wants to go all the way as high as 430. There's a lot of on-chain metrics showing that Binance is is seriously illiquid and that's on purpose. CZ knows knows what he's doing. The, those those guys over there, they're uh they're locking up that token, man. This Binance is gonna be here for a long time. So, so um yeah binance it's going to hit 430 in in a real crypto season but we're still you know taking it one swing at a time being grateful that we can even make some profit in such a challenging market okay um yeah but yeah binance definitely i see it hitting 430 in a couple of months um no matter which way this plays out anyways i think for now uh, 330 is a great place to be aiming for still. Um, I haven't even moved this to break even. I probably need to. On spot leverage, I already took it out. Um, what can I say? Bearish diversions right under undersold, oversold conditions, and you see a consolidation, and you see uh, you know some nice bullish engulfing candlesticks with a nice volume ramping pattern. Don't short that. That's just a nice taking a break, cooling down before we explode signal, in my opinion. So any pullback really is probably worth a buy to add into on a smaller time frame. If you can read these RSIs and you know how to en enter into the market on smaller time frames. Um, yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. I wouldn't be surprised if that's all we get here and then we start to continue sideways and up. Okay. Yeah, so Binance targets 330. That's my that's my idea for this. Uh I wouldn't short it. Be careful with with going with the shorts right now, obviously. Um make sure you guys know. Check us out once again on YouTube. Like and subscribe. FX Street Twitter is is FXS Crypto. I'm personally on TM Charts 100 where I post trade setups, on-chain analysis, market sentiment things. Um, thank you guys for those of you who have joined once again. And yeah, I will see you guys on the next one.